Welcome to Peter Cotter again, the entrepreneur journey. As I said in the videos that my entrepreneur journey is about me actually going on the journey and experiencing what I'm finding on the journey being an entrepreneur. Gaining the skills and the knowledge as an entrepreneur and actually doing it, putting myself in the front line, so to speak, and gaining the knowledge and seeing if certain techniques and strategies as I'm going along the journey works or not. Because I don't want you guys to waste time and I don't want me to waste too many too much time i want to see if the work or not work so it's like i'm using myself as an art uh, on the entrepreneur journey as an experiment and that's what my channel's about me gaining knowledge and doing it well there's one thing i've found is true on the entrepreneur journey because when I hear something from the gurus or I read something or I do something I, I give it a go and I want to see if it works myself I want to make a judgment myself I don't just listen to other people's opinions and take it on board and say they're correct I want to give it a go myself and see if I can gain from it See if it's true or not, or is it just a load of BS? So I give things a go. I won't just hear about it and think, great, that's fantastic, that must be true. No, I've got to give it a go myself. I'm not saying the word try. Try, I don't like the word try. That's why I'm saying giving it a go. I'll speak on another video about using the word try and <clears throat> how that small little three letter word can hold you back. But that's another video. No, I give things a go and I see for myself whether they work or not. Well, there's one thing I really do recommend and it does work 100% because I've tested it out myself and it's working for me and I want it to work for you guys as well. And what that is, is have you heard about the 21 day cycle to break any habit or form a new habit? Is that you do it 21 days or in my case 21 times but still 21 days i've done it in 21 days and then once after the 21 days you have formed a new habit and you don't have to consciously think about it anymore you just do it automatically like driving your car you don't think about changing the gears or the clutch or the brake, you just do it automatically. Well, that theory, as I've experienced, really, really does work. And I recommend it to everybody. Is that if you want a new habit or break a bad habit, you've got to do it within the 21 day period and cycle now within that cycle of 21 days if you skip at any time any one i'm afraid you've got to go back to the beginning and start again start the cycle 21 times so you've got not to skip you've got to do it exactly 21 times well, I've done this and I've experienced it. What I did it is by, I wanted 
to go to the gym. I've started a new fitness regime and going to the gym. Now, I wanted to go to the gym automatically in my routine and just have it as a normal routine in my life so I don't have to think about it. I've completed the 21 cycle and when I got to about, I would say about the 18th, I really did forget and not bothered about thinking about going to the gym. I just automatically got ready and drove to the gym. And it was like I was on autopilot. And I was conscious about it. And I thought, hey, do you know what? I didn't actually think about going to the gym. I just did it. I just got ready, got in the car, went to the gym and did the workout. I didn't have to think about it. I didn't have to uh, be conscious about it. I just did it. And I've done that now for going to the gym. And it's in my daily routine now. And I can't stop it. It's a new habit I formed. It's a brand new habit. And I don't even think about it. I, I never think now, oh, I've got to go to the gym. Uh, I can't be bothered today, but I've got to force myself and uh, I better go. And it's not like that. I don't have to force myself to go to the gym whatsoever. I just do it. And it, I fit it in my daily routine now. So it's a part of my life. It's a part of me just going to the gym. So I formed a good habit going to the gym, keeping fit. You can do this with anything. You can do it breaking a bad habit if you want. If you want to go on a diet, if you want to stop smoking or any bad habit, you've got to do it within the 21 days. And it works 100% guys. I wouldn't be saying this if it didn't work because that's what my journey is about. Experiencing things and then reporting it back to you guys and girls so you can do it. So give it a go. 21 days and you can break a bad habit, completely gone, or form a new habit, a new good habit, what you want to do. And you don't have to consciously think about it. Give it a go. It's worked for me 100%. I guarantee it. I did it for the gym. You can do it for whatever you want. Breaking habit or making a new good habit like I've done. So now I just go to the gym and just train. Don't think about it. It's a part of my routine. It's like breathing to me now. And that will be with me for life now. I probably will go to the gym all the time and I don't even have to think about it. I don't think, oh, you know, sluggish, you've been working or been, oh, I can't be bothered to go. No, I just go. And I find myself in the gym, I find I've done the workout and I'm coming out of the gym. Give it a go. The 21 day cycle will change and you can create good habits with a 21 cycle or get rid of bad habits. Keep watching, give me thumbs up, give me likes, keep subscribing and come along with me on the entrepreneur journey and let's experience together the skills and the knowledge of being an entrepreneur. And remember everyone, you take care of each other. Bye bye.